Hello everyone, in this video I will show you a new solution that you can use PC software, control this H32 bitboard controller and buy this RS485 bus. You can see uh, this is my computer and this is USB convert to RS485 and this is H32 bitboard relay controller. And I have used this 300 meter C85 network cable. So you can see I can use this cable connect it directly just as 485 a and b these two terminal so let's look at the pc software and you can see here is our pc software you can see i can click turn on relay one turn on relay two and then turn off relay two and you can see that i can control any channel of relay on and off and this you can see the LED indicate that have controlled by my computer so this can use for long distance uh, maybe your controller and your computer is long distance uh, max support 1000 meter so without network without wi-fi uh, without any internet so that is locally work because i just uh, config these settings by the network cable actually you can see i can remove this cable and control this controller and you can see i can turn on Turn on, turn on. So this can work without network, without any Wi-Fi and Ethernet. Okay, I will tell you how to step by step uh, use this software. And you can see this is our PC software. You can download from our website at here, that Kinkuni website and service software and document. And uh, you will see this IS485 PC software for H32 Pro Relu Controller. And you can just download from this link and here you can see this file have already download I can close it and I can open this exe file adjust uh, this file you can see when I open this software that state the release state is auto feedback from the H32 B Pro so this is my state have closed my uh, software before state so you can see I can turn on and turn off and this icon also can be changed by yourself uh, you can see the image photo and when it's on and when it's off so this have different two image you can replace by yourself maybe you have lamp or maybe you have motor or maybe you have cotton so you can replace by yourself and the next you will see the config.inf file so we can edit this file and here have some settings uh, what this means now I will show you you can see uh, the first title uh, King Kony Smart Controller H32 before that is this title so you can change this title by yourself your self software title or your company information you can replace it here uh, for example we can input my company logo at here this is my title and this is the size of this window so you can change this window size by yourself maybe you have used different pc monitor and this is the server port the com3 that is usb convert to my is485 adapt so you can check in your windows device manager and you will find what communication com port you have used this is com3 so i can set to com3 and this is brand rate and the date bit and IS485 information just as soon as you H32 Pro you can see uh, this is the web page of the internet setting at here that is IS485 settings so you just as soon as these sections 9600 9600 and this IS485 address 1 so this slave address is one so this is important one and one and uh, this band rate and this band rate and others you can see uh, this is now and this is now and uh, this is speed 100 milliseconds uh, to update the release date just every 100 million seconds will read the release date from the controller and this you can see this is the name that is 01, 02 this is the software name just this one uh, 01, 02 
if I change to lamp for channel 1, if I change to motor for channel 2, okay? And this is the icon image file which is off and which is on. Just we have shoot at here. Just use this name, you can see the default off and the default on. So you can replace uh, by yourself uh, for this icon image. And after you change every channel of radio output, you can see there are 32 channels. 32 channel. And you can close the file and save it. And you can reopen this exe file and click. And now you will see uh, this company name have changed for this title. And the channel 1 is lamp and the channel 2 is motor. So this have replaced by yourself just according uh, this INI file. So this you can make your own software uh, information by your company, no problem. So this is a solution how to use the Windows PC software for remote country by SFIT 8.5 uh, to continue really on and off. Thanks for watching.